What's good, everybody? It's your boy JB Trap House Boxman. I'm back again with another one, man. Uh, excuse me, man. I'm just uh, on a little quick break. So I'm trying to knock these grapes out and talk at the same time. But, uh, this video is proof that Deontay Wilder. And everybody else, but mainly Deontay Wilder listens to the LDBC videos. I seen the the Camp Life video with Wilder <clears throat> Gibbs, you know, was uh Nestor was interviewing him. I, I liked the interview, man. If, if anybody haven't watched the interview, go watch the interview. 30, 30 minute clip. Nice. Very, very excuse me, good interview, man. Uh Deontay Wilder said everything I wanted him to say. You know, uh, he is representing us as the heavyweight champion very, very well. I got, I got to really, really give him that, man. Like, it ain't really nothing that he didn't say that I didn't want him to say. Or he, you know, it's just everything was just right. So I want everybody to go listen to that clip, <clears throat> that full interview. And Deontay Wilder's on board, man. He's on board with what's going on. He's sticking firm to what he uh want. And he's gonna get what he want. And I was listening to Blood uh video earlier, man. Shout out to Blood Boxing, man. And he right, man. Uh Deontay Wilder don't need to bend for for fucking Eddie Hearn. You know. If they don't wanna if they if they wanna play chicken shit with this fight, fuck it, man. Don't even talk about it no more. Just let him come to you. Just do what you got to do. Fuck Eddie Hearn, man. You no. Know, uh, but Deontay Wilder has said what I had said already a while back. And he said that this fight doesn't need any more build up. What is there to build up? And he says everybody, if you look on Google search, you look on the internet, it's all everybody is talking about. That confirms what we all been saying. Everybody in the LDBC and plus whoever else been supporting this fight. So what's the excuse now? They need this fight needs to happen next. Walter also expressed that he's very uh he's cool, but he says that he got a lot of uh frustrate frustration uh build up inside. And he says that uh, he's gonna he's gonna convert that on over into the ring. So basically, you know, he says he's gonna teach these guys about you know uh, not putting enough respect on his name. Yeah, you know I mean. Um, he says that, you know, he he knows he's going to kill somebody in this ring, man. And he's, he's sending a fair warning out to everybody. He's going to, he know, he's going to have blood on his hands. But he says, he said, basically he broke it down to like black on black crime. He did an analogy. And he says he, he's going to hurt somebody real bad. He hate that to do with a fellow brother like that because he's another black man. But he says. The blood won't be on his hands. That's what he said. The blood will be on somebody else's hands. He said he warned this guy the first time. <clears throat> but, you know, whatever. So he said he's going to make an example this time. And everybody else who was after that. So the guy is going to hurt somebody, man. He's very frustrated. He just won't get in the ring. And, you know, he's ready to, he ready to, 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 to punch on some shit. So, um, but another thing I liked it the most is how he just debunked the whole ordeal about he said, oh, yeah. He said, yeah, everybody can say all the little shit they want to say about I'm awkward, I'm my, my technique and all this. He said, well, if that's the case, why they just won't fight me then? If it's that easy, why they just, why they won't fight me? He said, because one thing about it, he said, either you're going to have to, he said, I'm tall. I'm awkward. I got speed and I got power. He said, so 
He said, that if, if, even if you deal with the awkwardness, he said, you got to deal with that power. That's just it. This guy is sounds like a, a, a very, very confident champ. Everybody know that, and that's what they hate the most. But I, uh, Big Country said he, he going to sit here, he going he gonna, he gonna to hold his own, he going to do what he got to do. You know, he ain't going to get all out of, bent all out of shape. He gonna he gonna stand fast and whatever's coming to him is coming to him. And it's gonna come. The fight gonna come. But the thing is though, they should have see this and this is what I'm saying. Like this fight is so big to where why 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 they not talking about a a, a trilogy or a rematch out of Mackle have one over here and one over there in the UK. That's it. This fight can go on two, three times easy. People are gonna still want to see this fight, <clears throat> so I don't understand why they waiting and bullshitting around. But this fight gonna happen, man. It don't need no build up. The the, it, the fight was already built up. So, but y'all let me know what y'all think, man. I'm out.